Hey, what's up everyone and welcome to STEM Club this week. So this week we are going to be looking at some engineering and we're going to look at different structures. So as you can see, I've got two gumdrop structures right here that I made with just some gumdrops and toothpicks. And this is a pretty simple one. I think most people would kind of make this first, just a square. And then this one is more complex, and we'll talk about why this one is better in just a second. But first things first, we're going to test it out by just taking a big book and putting it on top of each structure, and we're going to see which one holds up. So let's try this. This is the square right here. Oh, falls over, kind of didn't fall apart completely, but it did fall over and yeah, it definitely bends. Now let's try this fancy one. It stays perfectly fine. And lift up the plate, move it around, take the book, set it down again, and this structure stayed perfectly stable. Now the reason for that is because of one shape that is very strong and used and really often in engineering when you're trying to create a really stable structure. See if you can kind of see what it is. We got triangles going all the way around. And that is what helps to keep this structure so stable. So what we do with this is we have five gumdrops that we place at the bottom and you connect those. And then you start putting in other toothpicks to make a triangle between each of these points. So. As you can see, it goes around and it makes a triangle each time. And then you put a little gumdrop right at the top to connect and make that triangle whole. And then in the top, you take toothpicks and you connect the tops of the triangles. It's easiest to first start with the five at the bottom and do it like I was saying and put a little gumdrop here and then Put another gumdrop here and connect those right away rather than just putting gumdrops all the way at the top and then trying to put in the toothpicks because then you have to stretch it apart too much. So that's how you make this cool structure that again, let's remember, is a lot more stable. I can even drop the book on it a little bit. But if I were to take and drop the book on this, let's remember what happens. It goes all over the place. No good structure anyway. <laughs> so I hope you guys have fun making that. And you can even go higher with this. You can make this. I'm not sure how many gumdrops you have, but however many you have, see how high you can go and have fun building. See you next week.